Monday, August 17, 2020. Hello, everyone. Welcome to this new edition of the Press Review on GDC Plus TV, where the press keep voicing national and international indignation following the recent gruesome killings in the northwest and southwest regions of Cameroon. We open with the media newspaper, which headlines Moyoka Horror Video, Righteous Outrage, Global Indignation. The paper says UNO, USA, Britain, France, national and international bodies, Southwest chiefs, women's groups have all condemned the barbaric killing of a 35-year-old woman by separatists on August 11 in Moyoka. And following this killing, the paper says soldiers stomped Moyoka and Motu and arrested hundreds. The same story finds voice in this edition of the Post newspaper, which writes that mass arrests sweep across Moyoka after gruesome killing of Comfort Tumasang. It adds that separatist leaders demand independent investigation into the heinous crime after global outrage. Read more on this in today's edition of the Post newspaper. From the Post, we move on to the Star newspaper, which voices the confessions of late Comfort Tumasang's in-law. The paper highlights that the latter debunks social media narrative on family retaliation indict separatist fighters and lament of a mass arrest of innocent civilians by the defense forces. Our next stop is the Guardian Post newspaper, which tells us that after the butchering of Comfort to Masang, another video surfaces with suspected amber fighters splitting their victim's head with an axe. The lone English daily writes that even as dust is yet to settle on the cruel butchering to death of a woman in the Makanga vicinity of Moyoka, for cultivation of the southwest region by suspected amber boys, a similar video surfaced over the weekend in which men posing as separatist fighters are pictured brutally killing a man, mutilating his cops. You want to read more on this? Grab a copy of the Guardian Post newspaper published this Monday and read page 3. And that does it for what the papers had to say today. Many thanks for watching. On to our next edition.